Hey everybody, it's Charlotte Prepper here. Um, before we start this video, be sure to like and subscribe if you have not yet done that. Um, I would love for you to be a part of this family. And uh, let's go ahead and let me tell you two things you've got to go ahead and stockpile on now. And I'm going to show you. The first one is garbanzo beans. Garbanzo beans you could do a lot with. You could um, you can make like a un chicken un tuna salad with. You know, put some mayonnaise in and um, make like a uh, a sandwich with. It puts um, mince some onions in and um, some salt and pepper. Um, uh, spices that you want. Um, I need to go ahead and get some dry beans. I did not get the dry in this. Um, this is one item in case we are not able to get meat and meat is getting a little high anyway. Um, and if you want to go um, the healthier way, um, get you some garbanzo beans. You could do many things with this. Um, like I said, you, uh, I just recently tried, which was today. Um, the the gar garbanzo bean unchicken untuna salad, however you want to say it, and it was really good. Um, I'm gonna uh, make sure I uh, put some onion in. I did not put onion in. I had to go run to the store and um, get me some onion. But in case you uh, you know don't have onion, you know you could leave that out. But you know, I would go ahead and start dehydrating some onion now. That way, if you want onion, you would have that um, in your um, your garbanzo bean chickpea salad. You could also make hummus. Um, you could also put it in um, different soups, um, and probably uh, like do other things with. The second thing, the second bean you need to stockpile on and have is black beans. So they come in the can and they come in the dry. Um, I did not, I <laughs> looked in my pantry and there was no chickpeas dry. So that's what I'll be getting probably this weekend. Um, but yeah, uh, black beans, you can make black bean burgers. Um, you could, um, Make like a taco salad. You can uh, put this in um, different recipes. And on the back of this can, it has a recipe for a uh, black bean salsa with pineapple. Um, you know, put it with some pineapple tidbits and some um, uh, bell pepper and um, onion and cilantro and some different things, olive oil, and make like a little salsa. So there's different uh, recipes you can get, you know, for the black beans and the uh, garbanzo beans means the chickpea uh, bean. So go ahead and get those items. I hope you like those items. Uh, if not, you know, and that's the only thing that's left to eat, what, um, that would be a good item to, to have around. Um, shelf stable. Um, and the, the date is long on those. Um, the expiration date, I think it's uh, like 24, let's see. Um, this one is not, so I definitely will be using this up because it's going to expire on November of 22. So I gotta make sure to put this in the front of my preps instead of the back. This one I just uh, got the other day, so. Um, it's good to, um, well, that's weird. That one actually says October 22. What's up with these dates? Um, but yeah, go ahead and get your beans. Um, I'll probably be using this up pretty soon, making me some more um, chicken salad. I, I, I just used one can for the uh, garbanzo beans, not chicken salad, the unchicken salad. Um, and you could, you know, put some eggs in that, you know, some, like some hard boiled eggs. Um, and, and dice up some, you know, and some peppers, 
uh, some relish, some vinegar, some mustard, and um, it really is good, y'all. The black bean burger I, I recently made uh, probably like a week or so ago, um, it was really good too. So and those are two beans that um, I definitely will need to stockpile on. And I hope that you would uh, consider that and maybe Google you some recipes and find you some ways on how to use these two beans and how, um, how many uses you can get of those two beans. So that's uh, two items I will be getting more of. And um, y'all have a great day. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.